This video is about the architect of modern India, Sardar Vallabhai Patel. Sardar Vallabhai Patel, also called as Iron Man of India, was born on October 31st, 1875 in a place called Nadiad in today's Gujarat. Patel is known for his work in integrating more than 500 princely states with India. He saw Gandhi as his political guru. In fact, he was a strong follower of Mahatma Gandhi. In 1917, he was selected as the Secretary of Gujarat Wing's Indian National Congress. In 1918, the British collected heavy taxes from peasants. Because of heavy rain, the peasants were unable to pay. Patel organized no tax campaign against the British. He studied law in England and practiced in Ahmedabad. He was a true nationalist. He had ideological conflicts with Bose and Nehru on adopting socialism. The Independent Act or Mountbatten Act gave freedom to the princely states to join with India or Pakistan or to become independent. Some rulers of the princely states saw departure of the British as an ideal moment to declare autonomy and establish independent statehood. To overcome this hurdle, he introduced the concept of privy purse. Privy purse means payment to be made to the royal families for their agreement to lower their autonomy in the princely states. It was Patel, who went to all 562 princely states and held conversations with its leaders. He ultimately succeeded in his attempt to join most of the princely states with India. It is because of Patel, the seamless transportation system from Kashmir to Kanyakumari that we are enjoying today has become a reality. Had he not taken this step, who knows, today each princely state could have asked for passport and visa to enter their territory. But then, there was a problem with the princely states of Hyderabad and Jammu and Kashmir. In case of Jammu and Kashmir, the king Hari Singh wanted it to join with India. But the king was in a state of flux. It was Patel who strengthened the military and air force bases there. He also established telephone and telegraph connectivity to Jammu and Kashmir. Later, Pakistan invaded Jammu and Kashmir and the rest is known by all. In case of Hyderabad, the Nizam of Hyderabad refused to join India. The Indian security forces marched into Hyderabad under Operation Polo. They dethroned the Nizam of Hyderabad because of which we have the twin cities of Hyderabad and Secunderabad today in India. Patel was the first Deputy Prime Minister of India. He had great chances to become the first Prime Minister of India, but on the advice of Gandhiji, he gave way to Nehru. He participated in freedom struggles initiated by Gandhiji, like Quit India Movement, Civil Disobedience Movement, etc. He was then arrested by British for several months. In 1928, he successfully led the agitation by landowners to raise their voices against the high taxes of British. His efficiency as a leadership earned him the title Sardar, which means leader. The formation of today's modern India was because of the Himalayan task upheld by Sardar Vallabhai Patel. Now, we have his statue known as Statue of Unity, which is the tallest statue in the world at a height of 182 meters. From 2014 onwards, 31st October is celebrated as National Unity Day or Rashtriya Ekta Divas to remember the birth anniversary of Sardar Vallabhai Patel. I end with his words, which is a motivation for many. Civil servants are the steel frame of India. We thank you for watching this video.